I'm gonna look back on this and be like, yo, I ate that, that's crazy. so easy to over order here there's so much good stuff everything on the menu is so good but yeah we're gonna start off with that order a couple drinks and then cook them right here oh let's go thank you these charcoals are super hot they cook for over an hour let's go guys he just loaded up the grill so we got right here four lamb marinated lamb skewers then right next to it is this is the best right here this is why I come here is that beef is so good this is the premium beef marinated skewers and then right here we got one order just one skewer of the pork intestines and then right here pork jowl this is actually new so it's gonna be my first time trying it and then at the end right here this is really good too this is the chicken gizzard and then right here chinese bun same thing doused in that red chili flake that looks crazy you gotta start with the beef this is the best this is my favorite thing on the menu always consistent but yeah i'm excited this looks so good even though they put a lot of that red chili flake gotta put more take this right off the skewer straight into that chili powder we're gonna do that with all the pieces right here when you're done with the skewer you put it in this little thing right here when the beef is in here you just start coating it i like it covered i like it where you can't even tell it's beef like this right here oh that looks so good had to load it up this is my first bite cheers mm. <laughs> Hits every time. Wow. It's so good. I can't get enough of it. This is like, this is like the, I think my favorite beef skewer I've ever had. But yeah, I love that chili flake. It hits, it's so good. Super flavorful. Mm. Wanna get some rice? Mm -hmm. To clear the palate. Cheers, guys. Fire. That's so good. So next, we're gonna try that pork jowl. I've actually never had it. I think it's new on the menu. Got it right here. This actually looks really good, but let's try it. Mmm. The pork flavor is so good. It has that like bacon flavor. It's like super potent and strong. Man, that's really good. Mmm. Wow. Oh, it looks like the lamb's already. You gotta take that off. They keep them warm up here because the charcoal is so hot, it still hits it from here. Got to throw these last two gizzards on here. Let's go. Damn, that looks so good. We're on the lamb. This right here is like the staple for like Chinese barbecue. This is the halal Chinese skewer. Let's coat that up. I'm wild. That looks insane. This is like a super fatty piece. And I'm so hyped for this bite. This is going to be so good. And this is the lamb, the marinated lamb. Let's go. Mmm. Wow. I don't know. That versus the beef, that's like neck and neck. Those are fire. That was so good. I feel like the lamb is actually more fatty. I can't get enough of that chili. Oh my gosh. Mmm. Oh my God, look at this. That looks insane, oh my. Look at how, it's like bubbling all the fat. It's almost done. We're gonna actually let it get a little bit more crispy. This is the chicken gizzard. Oh yeah, that's done. Gotta try it, let's go. All right, you know the drill. Coat it up, a little bit of rice, ooh. Chicken gizzard, let's try it out. Mmm. That's good, so chicken gizzard here, it tastes like tendons, but crunchier and juicier. So when you bite into it, tendon crunches, and it pops and there's like all this meat juice in there. All right, so the big buns are ready. I'm about to take them off and we're gonna stuff them up. Check them out. That red chili flake is like embedded in, in that bread. Let's figure out what meat we're gonna put in there. Something's telling me the lamb. Gotta put the lamb, all that fat on there. All right, so we're gonna assemble this slider now. Let's put this in here, look at that. Wow, cheers. Mmm, wow. That lamb juice just soaked into the bread. Made the bread so soft. And that chili hits through all the flavors. It's so strong, but you could put so much. It's crazy. Wash it down with one of these. Cheers. Mmm. 
Oh, I think this one's ready. Looks crispy enough. And that fat is still bubbling off. Oh yeah. My chopsticks are filling in. It feels hella crispy. Woo. Douse it up right here. I'm telling you, this is one of my favorite cuisines in the world, the Chinese barbecue. I don't know why, but the spices, the meat, everything goes so good together. That charcoal makes it taste so good. But yeah, gotta get this pork intestine. Let's go. Mmm. <laughs> wow. It's like, it tastes fried almost because of how crispy we got it. Like almost deep fried, wow. That's really good. Great way to start my night. Well, we gotta keep our skewer tour moving on to the next place. All right, guys, we're at Woody Kebab, and this is where I was introduced to Chinese barbecue. There's a couple new things on the menu, so let's eat. We got a soju for the appetizer. <laughs> All right, first shot here at Woody Kebab, cheers. Man, not too bad, but same concept as gui. This is cooked on fire instead of the charcoal. Gui is that Japanese charcoal here, it's just like a fire, it's like a stove. So the flavor is a little different. Starting off on the left side, we got the spicy beef with the red chili flake. And then right here, these two right here, right next to the beef, these are the beef tongue, and I've actually never seen beef tongue like that. Usually they're cut flat, like at Gui they're cut flat, but here they're cut up into cubes. And then right next to it, that is the wildest. I'm Actually, this is probably the wildest thing I've, I'm gonna eat on the tour today. Crazy, bull penis, wild, insane. Right to the right of that is uh, pork skin. I love pork skin, tacos, in any, any cuisine, I love pork skin. Let's actually try this kimchi right now. So they're the only Chinese barbecue spot that actually has kimchi. And their kimchi here is fire. Dripping juice, looks a little soggy, but still crunchy actually. Man. Mmm. Wow. So good. But look at all this smoke right here. These beef pieces are just like dripping fat and these beef tongue. That beef tongue looks so good. I think I'm most excited to try that beef tongue. Oh, that flame is hitting. <laughs> wow. That's the trick right there. My mouth is watering. Teasing me right now. This is crazy. Oh. Man, that smells insane. That smells so good. Spicy beef. Can't wait to try it. The beef is done. This is the spicy beef skewer. That looks crazy. Look at that like juice dripping out. Cooked to perfection. There's a little char on it. All right, so we're gonna put a piece of the meat in each one of these and try them out. First one gotta go in the, this is like a cumin chili. And this one is more of a grounded Chinese chili powder. And then right here we got that, that barbecue sauce, which looks insane. They all look different, different textures. But yeah, let's try it with this cumin chili barbecue powder. All right, first bite right here without rice. We're gonna try it, let's go. Mmm, wow, so good. The meat is so tender and then that cumin is just hitting. That flavor is fire. But yeah, with that rice, so good. Mmm, mmm, wow. And you gotta, after take a bite of meat, you gotta hit this kimchi. This kimchi is insane. It's so good. Such, so much flavor. Mmm. That piece was so crunchy, wow. Mmm, look at all that juice. I'm gonna have to put some of that on my rice, that looks insane. Oh, wow. The color of that is crazy. Let's try that. Mmm, wow. Sour, that's so good, wow. That's fire, mmm. All right, looks like this beef tongue is about to be done, so I'm excited to try that one. I'm hyped for this one. This is beef tongue. I love beef tongue. That's like one of my favorite parts of the, the cow. Beef tongue is so good. The, it it's like starts off with fat, and then it, as you go down, it's like it gets more lean. Cheers. Mm. Pure fat, 
beef tongue fat. Mmm. So flavorful. Wow. That one was so chewy. It was like jello. That was good. Man. Mmm. Wow, that was really good. Actually, that bite, that hit right there, that hit. Got to take another shot for that one. That one is legit. Cheers. Refreshing. Man, that bite made me happy. That was good. I think it's time for some crazy, crazy skewers. I'm going to look back on this and be like, yo, I ate that. That's crazy. This is bull penis. The texture looks insane. It kind of looks like tendony. Like it's going to be like chewy, not... It doesn't look that appetizing is what I'm trying to say, but the flavor could hit. So this is a first and I don't know if it's going to be a last. So I'm actually not going to put any seasoning on this because I want the full experience right now. I don't want to drown it out. We're going to try this and I'm going to give you my honest feedback. So cheers. Okay. Not bad, but tastes like nothing. Tastes like unflavored cartilage. I'll try it again. Let me let me put it on some sauce or chili though. So let's put in that barbecue sauce. It's like gelatinous, but like a little squishy, a little harder than than fat. But this one is. I'm gonna try this with the sauce. Hopefully, this makes it better. All I taste is the sauce, and then it's just like cartilage. But hey, I get to say I tried that. That's crazy. Wow. The last is that pork skin. I took it off the grill, and it's still bubbling. It's like so shiny and fatty. Let's try it out. Cheers. Mmm. Wow. So crispy. Mmm. And that fat is like getting stuck to my teeth. It's hard to eat, but it's so good. Wow. The outside is like chicharron, and then the middle is just like jello. It's, wow. Two crazy, crazy textures. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. I actually got another piece. This one's less crunchy. So I'm curious to try this one. It's like almost see through. It's like that fat color. It didn't get that crispy, but the edges are a little bit. So let's go. Mmm. And while you eat this, you get to stare at beautiful skewers. You're eating with your eyes and your mouth. It's so good. <laughs> and then I don't know why, but this is actually like my favorite kimchi I ever had before this year. Crazy. At a Chinese barbecue place, they got the best kimchi. Who would have known? Mmm. Wow. Mm. If you're in the area, you gotta come check them out. Woody Kebab, I really love this spot. But I'm saving a little room for our next spot. I'll see you guys at Late Night Bar. All right, guys. They just get hooked it up. Original soju right here. But look at their shot glasses here. They're like bowls. They're like mini bowls. Got the original again, had to. I like that one from Woody, so I had to get another one of these. Cheers. Oh, felt that one in my nose. The difference from this spot and the last two spots we went is they do not, you do not cook it in front of you. You don't have a grill in front of you. They cook it in the back and they bring it out. Let's get these chopsticks out. I'm already ready to eat. This looks so good and it smells insane. We're gonna start with that beef because the beef here is like, it's like their staple dish here. Have to. And it's so soft. It's crazy. Like, check it out. It looks kind of like minced beef kebab versus more a skewer. But yeah, that chili flake and the fried garlic on top is so good. So much flavor plus the texture of the beef. All right, I'm explaining it. I haven't even been into it yet, so let's go. Mm. Wow. The texture is like in between fat and lean beef. It, I can't even explain it. It's not like any other beef I've had. 
and that spice on top has a kick. So flavorful, spicier than the other spots we had today. Wow, man, let me get one more bite of that before we move on. It's so soft and juicy and I don't even know. Mm. It's different. You guys just need to come here and try it. It's one of my favorites and it always hits. All right, we're gonna move on to the next one. This is the chicken skin. This one's gonna be like a chip, so crispy. And the volume just turned up. It's going crazy in here right now. They're singing karaoke next to me and I don't mind, it's a vibe. So, chicken skin, let's go. So airy. You bite into it and it dissolves in your mouth. So good. It's like a chip but lighter. Wow. Mmm. Mmm. So flavorful. Should have ordered more of those. Those are insane. And the sauce they put on the outside is a little sweet, a little spicy. But that texture is so good. It's so light. I could have a hundred of those. Man. We gotta go with this pork intestine next. This is, I'm already out of words and I haven't even ate it yet, but I remember how this tastes. This tastes so good. Mm. Wow. Such a strong flavor of pork. It's like jello in the middle, but the outside is crispy. It's insane. So good. And not only that texture is good, that flavor is next level. It's so porky, it tastes, it tastes crazy, crazy, man. Oh wait, let's take a shot real quick, forgot. Got this whole bowl of broth, AKA soju, so let's hit this, cheers. Mm. Oh, that's so good. All right, back to the skewers. Gotta hit that chicken heart. I'm excited for this one. This skewer right here doesn't look the cutest, but it tastes so good. First bite of chicken heart of the day. Let's go, cheers. Mm. It was really crispy. Wow. Has a little bit of the same flavor of chicken intestines, if you guys have tried that. It's a little bit, a little bit dry. Hi. That's I got this mini, this one's for you. Thank you. Appreciate you, thank you so much. Wow. I'm just eating this chicken heart skewer and she brings over a gift because we're shooting. This is wild. I don't know what this is. You guys just need to see this. I don't even want to ask. I'm just going to try it. It looks really good. It looks like there's some like, is that flowers? <laughs> I guess we're going to work our way down to the left. But shout out to Late Night Bar. This is the spot I love. I, I come here so much and man, you just saw that. That's, that's so homey of them to do that. But let's try it. Cheers. No, that flavor was so good, but that flower almost made me choke right now. Whatever that was. I gotta hit another one of these. These are so good. Wow. Big bites only. Let's go. Mmm. That's how I'm feeling. Is that song right there. That's fire. <laughs> you come here and you have a full experience. It's crazy. They got the karaoke going. I feel like you're at a club eating these skewers. I'm all for it, it's so good. I'm just gonna deal with these flowers. I don't wanna be looking like a weirdo pulling these flowers out of the top of the drink, but whatever kind of shot this is, this is good. I love it, but cheers, let's go. All right guys, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my night. I gotta finish these last couple skewers and these last couple drinks. But thank you so much for watching my skewer tour. I'll catch you guys in the next video.